Okay, this is what I brought you down in here for. Where's the waterfalls, but also the lava. Because it's a spot where you can actually see the rounded layers where it poured out and piled on itself and bent over, doubled over. You see all the billows and the swirls and the pillowing of it all. This whole cliff face, this whole canyon on both sides at this point is either sediments and serpentine that have been totally warped by the heat of this coming up or it's this itself and this is like a big old intrusion and pouring out of lava a volcanic field this round surface that's actually one layer of lava and then the next one over it and the next one over it and the next one over it and all the way up and then now the water is eating down through it so we get to see all that See the massive layers here. Here's more billowing. So these actual rounded shapes that you see here are like where lava was pouring and then it cooled a little bit and the next glob poured over it and poured over it. Just making layers back and forth across here. So a cool chance to look at that. The old trees that have anchored down into it. Wild mission grapevines growing through the whole thing. See how deep we are in. As we get down here, you can start to see some of these are broken off from the river and the creek coming through and smashing it off. But in a lot of places, you can actually still see the roundness of where, when it was spilling out at this layer, it created a little gob that kind of cooled down and then the next one over it. And there's still separation, and roundness. I just think that's really cool. Layer, layer, garbage, garbage. Except we're at the top. There's more little waterfalls and on down. These waterfalls made out of willow roots.
can't believe that's staying for us. Okay. I think it likes us. Crazy man. See the layers here? This is what I'm talking about. So this layer poured out, cooled down, the next one poured over it, cooled down, the next one poured over it and cooled down, on and up until it built the layers of the mountain. And uh, now the canyon is eaten down to it. This front got smashed off, but you can still see the original pour out of that layer of lava. In each one, there's some more billowing looking areas up here. Just kind of a side view on some of them. Some layers. Where this tree has grown and been battered and battered and battered every year. Just gnarled its root water. Up. And those are pink willow roots. Yeah, layer, layer, layer. See how the how it gets trapped like that. Oh, pours no. Jasper borders. Look at these true roots, I believe that they're willow and they've gone completely hydroponic basically just living in the water and the nutrients of the water. It actually might be off the solder but I see a higher willow above it so 
from the looks of it, I, I believe it's a willow. Made literally a pink waterfall. But I warn you, do not take a nap in willow roots or they will probably eat you. Just something about a willow. And canyons go on and on and on and on. But we're going to have to call it done at some point. And the roots, the swirling of the actual rock itself. Ports in there, but it highlights the swirls. So this particular piece looks like it was a gray sandstone. And when this big intrusion of lava came by, it heated it so much that it literally liquefied almost. And then through pressure and shoving, it got bent around when it was heated like soft dough. And that's where you get that nice look. Metamorphosis has occurred. The layers here where the water has eaten away is soft in between. You can see it's sediments. Every time that you have slowed down in life to take in the details, you have been rewarded. Tiny fragments of thought, of the physical experience, whatever it was that made you feel clear and present and awake. It can be hard to locate and impossible most times to recreate. So the souls chase their own dragons round and round without change. And others chase the change sometimes too far until even home is strange. What is sought is the moment found and remembered after that was pure. A pause occurred someplace, sometime, in a larger event as part of some other experience, and in that time, that slow down of perception, you were able to be present. Somehow the world woke you from your day to day and the details rose to delight, begging to be noticed. They are always there waiting. And no matter how much and how close you look, infinite more are there. The whole universe spun out long before you and left the infinity of patterns in its wake. The whole song of this place, all the details of the notes 
forming the whole chords then tunes and from somewhere before after and beyond all of this they are the one song but we are here amongst the details part of the music creators of our own dreams arts and inventions look for it wherever you are wherever you go slow pause let the universe wash over you find grand designs and tiny patterns that make the whole and connect us all and see it taste it smell it hear it and feel it